That's your boy Will coming to you live and in living color. Today is August, Monday, August the 22nd. And it's another another beautiful Monday, another fresh week, another uh, motivational Monday. Again, I want to thank everybody for all the support lately. I just got done working out, so I'm kind of out of breath a little bit, but it's all good. And um, today what I wanted to talk about was someone who I was dealing with this week. You guys know I'm in the medical field, so I come across a lot of people. I deal with a lot of different people, and I see a lot of different things. But this guy right here actually stood out to me uh, because he having, he's having different problems going on with his, with his health now, all right? But he was telling me about his trip he's getting ready to take. I think he told me he was going to Mexico or he was going to Cuba. He was going somewhere like that. And he was going to be there for about two weeks. And he has a daughter that lives in Florida. And he's going to uh, stop by there on the way back. So he's going to be going out of town. He told me a little bit over a month. About a month, a little bit over a month. And he's having issues. He has... Uh, I'm not going to put what he has out there, but he's having issues with his health and he worked in the mine for over, I think he told me 40 something years, you know, he's in his mid to late sixties now. And he's just now really starting to try to live life. He's been retired for a couple years. So now it's his time to really just go places and do things and spend time with his family. And you know, if it's one thing, if it's one thing that stood out to me, this guy really and truly, he's not going to really enjoy himself. Not like he really wants to because his health. He doesn't know if he can actually be gone for this long period of time without something going wrong with his health. And if it's one thing that I, I learned from talking to him, I don't want to get into my 60s, early 70s and just start to live it. Okay? I don't want to be that person that, you know, worked his whole life. And he worked in the mine, so I'm pretty sure he made some good money down there. And I'm pretty sure it was pretty addictive, the, the paychecks every week. But I don't want I don't care how much money I make, I don't ever want to forget to live my life. I don't want to forget to spend time with my family, go places, do things. You know, if there's one thing that I value in life, it's time. And that's one of the reasons why so many people, you know, decide to go into you know, working for themselves and, and doing things like that. I mean, it's hard work either way you look at it, but I mean, you can kind of have a little bit more time to do some of the things you want to do. And I and I think it's important that you spend time with your family and your friends and the ones you love and do the things that you really love to do while you're here, you know? So, you know, when I talking with him, I mean, it just made me realize that, you know, I really and truly need to you know, start to live in a little bit more than I've been living. You know, I love to travel. I love to go places. I love to spend time with my family. You know, I love to do things with my friends. But at the end of the day, you know, we all have to work. We all got to make some money. But it's some things that, you know, can wait. It's some things that you're just going to have to just say, you know, I do that later. You know, I'm going to spend some me time with me and my family. I'm going to go out. I'm going to go enjoy myself. I'm going to go spend some time doing the things that I love. You know, don't get so caught up and wrapped up in making money that you forget to live your life. I mean, I don't want to be that old talking about living life. I want to live life now while I'm actually young. I'm able to go places. I'm able. I have a good quality of life now. And that's the main reason why we should work out and start to, you know, invest in that time now into working out because you want a good quality of life later on in life. You don't really know what type of cause you're going to be dealt but. Working out can really improve your quality of life when you get older, you know. So that was kind of messed up, you know, that he worked so many years and he probably got a lot of money put back and saved, but he can't enjoy it. Can't enjoy it. All right. So that's my message for today, guys. It's Monday. It's a beautiful week. I had an awesome weekend. Um, I just, you know, I just been enjoying life and just doing the things that I like to do. And spend the time with the ones that I love. You know, I, that's what I like to do. So, right now, what I'm about to do is I got done working out. I'm actually about to go home, shower up, and um, get ready to go to work. And coming, starting starting in September, I want to start probably doing more weight training, more weight lifting. 
I haven't been doing a lot of weightlifting, guys. I promise you. I, I do a little lifting weights, but I don't work. I don't really lift a lot of weights that much. Um, I just do a lot of body weight workouts and exercises and things like that. CrossFit, that's something I've been doing uh, since October. I really love it. It's a full body workout. And yeah, you work out with weights, but I'm not doing heavy, heavy weights in CrossFit, man. That's a hard sport. <laughs> you know, if you ever think about doing CrossFit, uh, you're going to work. You're really going to work. So I'm just rambling right now, guys. I'm going to get off the mic. I'm going to um, catch you guys next Monday with another motivational message. And I'm looking forward to, uh, you know, seeing you guys putting up your posts this week and, and, and having fun in life, all right? Catch y'all later, man. Don't forget to smile. Don't forget to live your life. Don't forget to laugh. Don't forget to, you know, do the things that you want to do, all right? Catch y'all later. Peace out.